Good morning. Good morning. Good morning. I love you. Good morning. I will be on later live to chitty chatty with you. A chitty chitty bang bang. A chitty chitty bang bang. We're going to do Aquarius Leap of Gemini. And we're going to start with Aquarius. Aquarius, please, Aquarius. Call to another deck. <clears throat> Page of coin. New stats. New insight. Beautiful eyes. Hat chakra, maybe. But this is a new job. I'm just putting time somewhere. <clears throat> it's fresh, though. It's fresh. So fresh and so clean, clean. It's the smell of Irish spring, gents. I don't know why I left my ladies out there. <laughs> I don't know what that's all about. <clears throat> totally seeing a drag queen show, too. Totally. Get it. Get it. It almost wanted... Here's the thing. I grabbed it. So for some, for sure. It, it was like stuck, but it went back in. So I don't know if this, I would read that as straight up competition. Competitive energy. I'm just kind of gonna do that. Cause I think it's, I think it might be out of the picture. Of course, you know, some of you are arguing. That's too many. Was the five of pens, the moon, a couple other ones, but Aquarius, please. Can I get two more for Aquarius? Come on, wake up. I think Libra's gonna get that too. I don't know why. There it is, please. All my jammies. <clears throat> look at look at the the earth. got a new start on the board there's there's no question there's there's no time to be like uh, you're just no one's no one's like oh no one's just thinking about the past like this one screwed me or in the past I got screwed over like it's just it's it's not there you're not thinking about heartache whoever that's for tell me about the page of coin so you could be dealing with any earth or water sign. You got somebody that's talking about their feelings. It's it's a brand new world. It's it's just a fresh start. Um, it's it's almost like I see temperance all over the board. Tell me about the page of coin. So if you're in a relationship, you you fix you fix something. That I I truly feel is that's past tense energy. It's just ironic. Page of coin. It, it's it's like they want me to group you all together, and I'm not. This is Aquarius, so I think we're gonna see very similar energy. And we got the seven of cups. So someone who was confused now knows which option to choose. And I think it has Empress at the bottom of the deck. It has to do with home life, a, a, a personal situation. <clears throat> Even if it's work, it'd be personal. Um. Coming out of confusion, confusion, picking the right steps. Yeah, that's way too many. It's like seven or eight. Tell me about 
no longer stressed out. Karmic scales are here. Something's going to be balanced. <laughs> the star came down, which is, you know, you guys, but it's also blessing this healing as it came down on the Knight of Pents. Talking about moving forward, fighting for what you want. So if you're having a conversation that involves emotions, um, it's a win. Someone's opening up. Tell me about the Knight of Cups. Which we had the star energy, right? So this did a 360, 320, 40, 80, guys, <laughs> whatever it is. This, these are links. Tell me about the tower. You're no longer going to feel, yeah. Yeah, it's, it's like a new contract, feelings, somebody's opening up. This is pretty much a, a new start for someone. Blessing in disguises, fighting fighting to have what you truly, truly want, what your soul is calling. It's, it's all feelings. No longer being stressed. You guys must have been arguing. <clears throat> Tell me about the five of wands, because that's, that's the aftermath, like... I don't know what you were arguing about, but some type of karmic contract. Yeah, see, it's the aftermath. Some type of karmic contract is over. Moving forward, it's all about your feelings, time, where you're investing. Um, what was I going to say? I was going to say, get a sip of my coffee. It's, it's definitely blessings. Sigh of relief. If you're still in the midst of arguing, it won't last much longer. Someone's going to say something, provoke someone. It, it, it's, you're not going to feel that loneliness. You just won't. I do honestly feel like somebody in this picture, though, when somebody moves forward, somebody is going to be hurt and left out with the five of pence in the tower. Because it could be a third party or somebody leaving a situation ship, like leaving a karmic contract. But they're going right towards what their soul wants. There's no more confusion. Congratulations. This couldn't have been easy. You must have been arguing for a while. Last five weeks, five days, been up in the air. But mind you, you got two fives. Which is a 10. It's, it's a new stat. So congratulations, my little Aquariuses. I, you know, I'm no longer thinking about the past like that. Laying it to rest. Princess of Pences popped. Princess of Pences. Princess of Pence popped out. So let's move on to Libra. So that that's refreshing. Someone is no longer holding on to... The past, I mean, might it come up here and there? Yeah, because that tower, right now it's a, it's a fresh start. If somebody loves somebody or they're still with somebody but they're focused on you type energy, right? It Eventually that tower, eventually there'll be another tower. Right now that, that tower was to benefit a relationship. But somebody eventually is going to be left out. Libra. Two of Wands, choosing a path, moving forward, looking at something different differently. I get opposites attract with that card. New start, magician. You can do it. You want to create something that's already manifested. It's a new opportunity. Do you believe in magic? King of Swords. Okay, my little Libra's and Aquarius energy. <clears throat> At the bottom of the deck, you have the Knight of Swords. So, <clears throat> with the Palace of Swords. This is definitely a new direction. Talking about it, conversating, could be a new business. It, it's just, it's a brand new, it's a path. I don't know if you've chosen or not, but you got mind, body, and soul on the board. 
direct conversation. <clears throat> Tell me about the tool ones. From my little librarians. Step into the light. flipped over. Alright, hold on. <clears throat> I'm just texting my daughter, have a fantastic day with all our little emojis. <laughs> so, you guys are going to have a good day. You do have to step into something though. Tell me about the two of wands. It doesn't have to be today per se, but it's a roundabout, that's for sure. Tell me about the magician. So you got Scorpio Pisces energy. Someone's in love. Somebody wants to even out the scales, create balance, ground a situation. You got two sixes, you know. Six is the number of harmony too, okay? And there's that princess of wands that wanted to pop out at the very end of the Aquarius energy. So this is a brand new start. So you guys are all linked. What's, what's this message? It's very direct communication. This is somebody, the four of cups popped out. So it's it's somebody you know too. You got the chariot and the king of swords. So two people are going on the path moving forward. Aquarius energy, Libras moving forward. There's there's no in between. This this message is all about clear cut, cut communication, and Aquarius knows how to have clear communication. Okay, um, again, it's moving forward with the water sign, or just it's all about feelings and and balancing out a situation. So, let me look up sixty six real quick. To have faith, put your trust. <clears throat> into the universe, supporting and manifesting your goals, desires, and wishes, positive thoughts, and you have the magician. So the balance, the victory, all that's coming. If it's not already here, make sure you have lots of gratitude, okay? But it's, again, it's it's the balance, balance between your material and spiritual lives, which is material, spiritual, okay? It's, it's also a divine mission. I don't really see that there, but it is. Okay, um, transmutation, so that means you went through heck to get here. Dark night of the soul, for sure, okay. And, you know, regarding the 66, 66 also suggests that in regards to your home and family life, and enjoy the relationship and the companion that you chose or, it's on, or is on its way. Okay, make sure you love freely and unconditionally. So, it's all about, all about the feelings for you. Computer timed out. Okay. So, <clears throat> again, if you haven't had this conversation, you're about to. Whether it's work, love, it looks like a companionship though, moving forward, having a new start. Even if she's an adult, she's coming in very, very free. Okay. Yes. It's manifested. It's, it's here. It looks like they chose. They chose a path. It's, it's clear. And if that's not clear to you, it will be soon. Well, go watch your sun, moon, rising Venus, right? Make sure you're watching your seventh house, too. <clears throat> In this energy, <clears throat> find out where your seventh house is. <clears throat> All right, my little jammies. All right, my little jammies. Me and me, my little me and me. Boom, boom, boom. Some of you have, um, you're twisting the little things like on snow globes, things for you, your infants. Sweet. Boom, boom, boom. It might be going off by itself. If that's the case, it's a simple hello. Hello. All right, Jimmy's. Mm, it's chunky. It's like you got you got stacks that want to talk to you right now. 
my little Geminis. Next couple weeks for my little Geminis. Next couple days, I did say weeks. But this is current energy. Next couple days for my Geminis. This wants to make an appearance. Grounding a situation, balance, no longer juggling. We could be dealing with a cancer. <clears throat> Praising the Lord. Dear Lord, thank you for bringing this fabulous woman into my life. <laughs> or you are a cancer with a Gemini, Gemini placement. So you know, at the bottom of the deck, you got the page of coin. So it's all about your feelings. You're coming in as a cancer. That's nice. It doesn't happen so often with you guys. It must be a strong placement right now. Or it's, again, all about love with you guys. Feelings. Lots of sexual energy with that dolphin right now. <clears throat> Someone's having sex. Do, 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 do. Here we go, loop de loo. Here we go, loop de la. It's like kid like energy. Tell me about the tool coin. Tool coin, please. Tool coin. Gemini. Someone's got, you know, someone's expressing feelings. It's who you are. And it's, it's new to this person because here they're the younger one. Okay, six of pence. There we go. There's that balance. Healing's taking place. You're grounding a situation. Making choices. Choosing to balance out the scales. Could be dealing with a Leo, but that's that's growth. Someone's showing a lot of growth, maturity, happiest deck in the card. You know, you got the four of pence, so it's like needing to release something but it also talks tell me about the four of pence the four of pence is a lot talks a lot of stability so it's like lighten up a little bit spend spend a nickel or two um or it's saying you held on and it paid off because this read looks very positive yeah you got the you got the moon Something's coming in with the moon that we just had. The Aries moon. This already happened. It's like, it's like future energy. Tell me about the Page of Cups. Whatever happened around the time of the moon for a Cancer energy, or Leo, or Gemini, it's, it's beautiful. Yeah, see, it's, it's that communication. Someone told you how they feel, or it was mutual back and forth. Tell me about the moon. The moon brought in clarity. So you can have this balance. Is what it is. So the yeah, see look at that. Got it twice with the princess and the page. So you're both on the same page when it comes to your feelings. Arguing's done. Tell me about the page of coin. So it makes a lot of sense that um Seven of Swords, you guys talked about the past. You got through it, especially if there was any self-sabotage, because this is now positive. Tell me about the Seven of Swords. It's not saying there's something deceiving going at, down at work. Maybe for some of you, yeah, but not now. So you, you fought. You fought for it. Fought, fought for a new start. There's that feelings again. Ten of Cups. Once again, you are linked. This Ten of Cups, this new start. See what I'm saying? You are linked. Somebody gets left out of a situation which is which is hard um 
but it's, it's a new start for someone and with justice that's 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 coming out that all this because the minor kind of the six of pence is you know it's, it's the me it's uh, the, minor, the major arcana the you know is the is justice it's it's karmic balance you know so um it is unfortunate that there is a situation where you know someone does get left out and if it's you hang in there but it, this is not it's not one of those like oh what a dick or a bit like obviously you would say that right but like it's not where you're supposed to be when karmic justice comes into play it would never last it's one of those things you, that you would just settle for years and years and years and years and somebody finally was like I'm not doing it anymore because they really got some true feelings for someone which means if you're the one on the opposite that gets left out you know it's only a matter of time before you find yourself and you find what's what's meant for you you know eventually that will come to you too I promise you that all right so i got logged out again i love you guys have a fantastic day